Hey everybody, it's Andy back in the Maker Lab at Micro Center and today's a very exciting day as we're taking a look at the Creality K1 3D printer. This is Creality's latest offering and it's been pushing the boundaries of its previous printers, especially when it comes to speed. So we've received a sample unit ahead of launch and it's a very early look. This is not a review, but more a broad overview of the 3D printer itself. We're excited to get these into Micro Center stores so you, the customer, can come check it out in person and take one home for yourself. All right, one more for you fans of peeling the clear stuff off of new products. So satisfying. So Creality has sent us a sample of their Hyper PLA White, but because we're inland filament, we're not going to use that. So I've preheated the machine and we're going to go ahead and load some True Red PLA Plus from Inland Filament. Let's jump in and take a look at some of the specs that the Creality K1 boasts. First off, it's boasting 600 millimeters per second printing speed, hands-free auto leveling, die cast parts on the frame, and an auxiliary cooling fan in the chamber. Now the K1 Max also offers LiDAR and a built-in camera, which you can upgrade the K1 to have as well. It offers a dual gear direct extruder and a hot end with a titanium alloy heat brake and copper alloy nozzle. It includes a flexible build plate. The K1 includes a 4.3 color touchscreen and a build volume of 220 by 220 by 250 millimeters. Well, we hope you enjoyed this first look at the Creality K1 3D printer. Make sure to stay tuned to Inland Filament for more videos. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time in the Maker Lab at Micro Center.